You're watching Cricket World TV. I'm John Pennington. I'm joined by Amit Master. And we're looking ahead to the 2011 World Cup. We're looking at Sri Lanka. Amit, Sri Lanka were one of the very first teams to name their final 15-man squad. What does that tell you about where they are at the moment? I think uh, they have a very good clarity in terms of which outfit they're going to field in the forthcoming World Cup. Full marks to Arvind the Disarwal at Selection Committee, really. And uh, let's have a look at that squad now. Were any sort of surprises there? The only surprise was to leave out uh, the Suraj Randeev uh, being uh, the informed spinner and can extract a certain bit of bounce on those surfaces. Now, are two very high-profile players not involved, of course, Sanat Jaya Saria and Shamin Devas. Any, any thoughts on their exclusions? Slightly confusing matter to me because uh, Cheminda Was and Sanat Jaisuriya both are into the wrong side of their age and having picked up in the preliminary squad, it was uh, unexpected lines really to leave them out of the contention into the World Cup squad. Now one player who was involved back in 1996 when Sri Lanka famously won the World Cup in the brilliant final against Australia, Matai Muralidharan, he's back again, probably his swan song this time though. Yes, Murlidharan would like to contribute with the ball, importantly, uh, to get the top order batsman out and play a vital role in Sri Lanka's success in the forthcoming World Cup. OK, we've mentioned Murali, probably a key player. Who else do you think will stand out for Sri Lanka? Tilak Ratna Dilshan at the top of the order has got a huge role to play for Sri Lanka because uh, he's such a clean striker of the cricket ball and can really get them off to rollicking starts. Now, uh, what about uh, any other bowlers to look out for? I think in the bowling department, uh, they've got uh, Kulasekra, who's got a very good uh, ability to pick up wickets up front and uh, invariably ends up picking two or three top order batsmen in his first spell. Now, we've uh, talked a little bit about this. Uh, Sri Lanka have got an exceptional World Cup pedigree. They're co hosting the tournament. How far can they go? they can go the distance uh, simply because they've got a very good mix of experience and youth on their side. Uh, Kumar Sangakara and Mahila Jayavardhana constituting that middle order would do a world of good to their chances in the forthcoming World Cup. Good stuff. Thank you, Amit. I'm actually going to go on long similar sort of lines. Sri Lanka, for me, I think they're going to be runners-up.